All right, let's see here. That's all RAM, CPU stuff. Mm, oh, there it is. All right, there it is. Three fan, PCI, RGB. This is actually pretty cool. Show it to you real fast. It's brand new. All right, that's what I need. I'm going to see if it works. Let's go out to the garage. So I just got my Christmas tree up and stuff. Now you can see all my doors are open right now. I got my rabbit outside. There's her cage over there. From the sounds of it, it sounds like the dogs are outside. Hey, what are y'all doing? Yes, the garage. So, how... Whoa, that's wobbly. I'm sorry. So, how is everybody doing today it is so good to see you make sure i can see where i'm going so the garage does it look like i'm making some type of effort progress something anyway guys it is great to see y'all um i have been making progress slowly you can see i have started on this side now we're waiting for the tabletops to come in so that way I can finish that one. And then once we finish them, see these aren't even done yet. I still have to uh, finish building them, reinforcing them, painting them. But, you know, work is being done. You can see that wall over there starting to kind of get stripped down. <coughs> I have been making somewhat effort. There's this just stuff everywhere right now all of my computer rc car stuff it's all being displaced right now see rc car with computer stuff what do you expect like over here on the floor i have reservoirs and a gun cleaning kit so i mean all my stuff is just kind of mixed together right now there's really nothing i can do about it anyway the reason is because of this video is that Yes, it's straight. I swear it's straight. I leveled it and everything. But I um, I thought that, that it was kind of plain. I mean, you can see what I was talking about, how you can't put RAM on it. See how the heat pipes overrun the RAM modules there? See that? You can't run RAM because the dang thing goes past so you can't run that so that's it's a dead motherboard this is what we're going to do with it we have this i thought well you know it's a little bit boring maybe i could uh kind of bling it up somewhat so i got this thing which is pretty cool and um it lights up and stuff i thought that maybe it would look cool like up there I would like to get it this way, but I don't have a vertical bracket that I could spare right now. So I'm going to install this up here, and we're going to see how that looks. Oh, and I need to show you one more thing. Check this out. See the blue light? It's pretty cool, right? Well, anyway, it runs all the way underneath. So when everything is done, these are going to be painted gray with a black drop, and then underneath all the way down and along around is going to be this blue light underneath it see it runs all the way around and that's really going to add a cool effect because when everything is painted all right it's painted gray and then the backdrop is black with the blue lights on it i mean this is really going to look cool when i get this all set up can you guys start to kind of see Look how big this table is going to be, guys. Look how big I'm making this. I want a huge work table. Now, the good question is, is how do you get to the stuff in the back? You reach for it. That's how you get it. We're also going to make it more uh, appealing and stuff to me. <sighs> I still have this computer project over here that I'm working on. We'll get to that uh, let's hang that thing real quick, but I just kind of want to show you guys that blue underglow. It's going to look good, man, once it's all done. See, that adds just the right amount of perfect. Doesn't that look cool? See what I'm saying? 
I think that looks way better. Now, that's not exactly how the wire is going to be. Um, I just kind of have it mocked up to show you guys. I have to figure out how to get that thing to stay in place. And I need to hardwire it. But I just wanted to show it to you guys first. And yes, it does. It changes colors. That's pretty cool, right? So hopefully when I get this all done, um, it will look way awesome. I know right now it's a mess, but I can see the image. I can see what it's going to look like when it's done. And it's going to look phenomenal. I still need to hang up my wire and everything, but... I just wanted to show you guys that. I mean, it's it's pretty cool. Uh, oh, hey, check this out. I've realized taking all of this stuff apart and taking all this stuff out, I have realized that I have a lot of computer fans. And I mean a lot. So what I'm thinking about doing, I saw a really good idea on Gamers Nexus. They had all of their fans on bookshelves. Like on a bookshelf. They had all of their fans on a bookshelf. And it looked great. I was like, good idea. I was like, what a great idea. I'm going to do that. Let's get a bookshelf and I'll put all of my fans. Because I have a lot of fans. And see, like that, it takes up a lot of shelf space. There's two goals that I'm trying to achieve here. One, I don't want a million things on the wall like this. I don't want that anymore. Two, I don't want a million things anymore. So I'm going to have to figure out what to do with all of this stuff. Who is calling me?